Hey there everybody and welcome back to Let's Play Pikmin. We're going to do challenge mode. Now challenge mode is an interesting little feature. It will it'll allow you, if it comes up right now, it will allow you to do all five levels and the only goal is to uh, try and make as many Pikmin as possible in one day. I thought I'd show you this. It's an interesting little uh, feature. And the way, reason why it's interesting is because, well, there's there's some new there's new enemies around. Oh, I'm out of breath now. <laughs> Sorry about that. Um, there's, if you play one of the other levels, then you'll see new enemies. But you'll also see, say, there's a bread bug at the top right-hand corner there. And that's a new enemy for this place, because usually there's no enemies here at all. Now, what you're going to do is just make Pikmin. Make as many as possible. I have nine at the minute. Let's see how many we can get, shall we? <laughs> Uh, this should be the last part of my Let's Play, by the way, guys. So, um, yeah, I hope you all enjoyed. I hope you all enjoyed the uh, the uh, what, was it? What, what am I going to call it? The pick the prog the Pikmin Prog Massacre, yes, where uh, a load of uh, well uh, the Smoky Prog kicked my Pikmin army army's ass. Yeah, that thing is really is devastating, and it's so it's so unfair that you can actually uh, lose Pikmin to it. It will not lose Pikmin to it, but it can actually uproot Pikmin. Uh, up, actually uproot Pikmin. Yeah, that's the words I'm looking for. I think that's nasty, don't you think? And yeah, it's rather slow at doing it, but still, it, it's it's still a pain in the ass. I'm gonna kill this bread bug because it's, it's annoying me. <laughs> in fact, no, I'm not, no, I'm not actually. I'm just gonna get everything else. So uh, yeah, let's let's go make some Pikmin. Now this isn't going to be a high score, believe me, it won't be. Um, I'm not that great at challenge mode. I rarely play it. It's an interesting little um, side quest. Well, not side quest, but a distraction from the main game. Because the main game can be a bit of a drag sometimes. If you're not sure what to do, then it's it's quite a nice distraction just to make Pitman. I'm up to 14, probably not the best score in the world. Uh, yeah, but this is this is just challenge mode. It's as simple and easy as that. All you gotta do, make Pikmin. There's there's no monsters to worry about. There's no uh, smoky progs or spotty bulb orbs or whatever. <laughs> there is one thing I didn't show you. After the credits on the good ending, I think it's only on the good ending, you get a little um, cutscene. And it's showing you all of the, well, most, well, I think it's all of the monsters that you'll face within the game, including things like the BD Long Legs, Emperor Bullbax, all that jazz. And I think that's pretty cool. I didn't get to show it you because I totally forgot about it, to be perfectly honest. And it does show you about the candy pot buds in that little cutscene as well. So, again, it's absolutely mystifying how I've not. I've never known about the candy pot buds, their buds, and how they work. <laughs> Absolutely mystifying. Oh, hello, Fiery Jet. Yeah, you will see some differences in these levels. For example, I think you might see uh, bosses like the Gulix, which you're only supposed to see on the impact site in a different uh, level. I'm not sure which level, um, but you'll see them in a different level. So it's just interesting to see what they've actually done. And it, it can be quite a challenge to get a high score. It, it's very uh, arcadey. I think that's a word. It is now. It's very arcadey in that there, it's a high, you go on a high scoreboard, and I like that. I like it a lot. What are we up to? Um, we're up to 29. Not bad, but I want more. I'm going to see if I can get at least 100. If I can get 100, then I'll feel I've succeeded. <laughs> I wasn't exactly going to show you all of the... Um, all of the challenge day, but you know I might as well. There's only two. It's only two extra videos, so I, I might as well show you. See what if we actually get to a hundred. If we do, then then drinks are on me. Hooray! <laughs> right, uh, right. Where are all my Pikmin at? Uh, you don't actually need to pick the Pikmin in order to count them to your total, so that's good at least. However, you will need more Pikmin to get the tougher. Um, you know, the tougher... Uh, well, I can't think then. The to, to get them to the tougher places. And now you'll remember that there was a stick on uh, here which you were able to throw your Pikmin... Well, get your Pikmin up in order to get up here. So you don't need it uh, this time. Stay up here, stay up here, stay up here. 
Uh, I've got 12. You actually don't need it this time, because all you, all you need to do is just throw them up there and then use the geyser. <laughs> Remember that geyser, which I, I never knew where the geyser was. <laughs> well, I do now. Stay there. Stay there. Stay there, breadbug. Yeah, you could. Yeah. Oh, the breadbug died. Fantastic. Poor breadbug. Oh, I like the breadbug. The breadbug's so cute in a twisted way. Right, let's get all these home. What am I up to? 44? That's pretty good. Right, let's get these lot working on these two seeds. I'm from. You can actually go away from this area. You know, remember when we pushed the box and we got to see uh, Mamuta on uh, day 8, I think it was, all those days ago? Well, you can go up there and you can go see the clam. I think there might be clams up there. I'm not quite sure. In fact, you know what? Instead of just being unsure about it, let's go have an explore, shall we? Let's see what's around here. So, as ever, you need to push the box. And, and oh yeah, there's quite a lot of seeds back here. There's, that one's covered by fire, fire pit. So best not uh, dazzle with, well, dabble with that one. Unless I have 20 red p uh, Pikmin with me, but I don't think I do. Push it, push harder, guys. Good. I think the music's slightly different. Either that, or it's coming weird through my uh, my laptop. I'm not sure though. I'll have to listen back to it. But anyway, let's get more Pikmin, more Pikmin, we need more Pikmin! <laughs> I kind of find that last ending kind of sad, even though uh, Pik uh, Olimar actually survived. I find it kind of sad that he that he won't get to see his family. Especially after hearing things like he got um, a gemstone from his daughter and his son and he keeps it with him on his ship. And the way he talks about his wife as well, as well it, it's, you know, it's... It, it's not It's not like uh, Final Fantasy VII when uh, What's-Her-Face gets killed by Sephiroth. It, it, no, it's not that kind of sad, but it's still sad in the end. It's, it's, maybe because it's little, maybe because he's a little guy. Maybe that's why I find it so sad. Maybe the cute size of him uh, makes it a very sad ending. At least he gets to survive. That's the main thing, right? He gets to survive as a Pikmin, even though he looks like uh, uh, Mr. Saturn. <laughs> But yeah, yeah, we, we got away in the end, I'll show you the good ending. I'm just, I'm so proud that I actually got that good ending. I didn't think I'd get there. Oh god. It was, it was, it was the distant spring which gave me the confidence to actually finish it because uh, we got all those pieces relatively easy and the distant spring is pretty hard. I wouldn't say it's quite as hard as Forest Naval, but I'm sure many of you will disagree with me there. <laughs> but yes, finally. Finally, completed it. Completed it. I have no idea what my next LP will be. <laughs> I, I, I just want to sit down and relax for like a year now. <laughs> now I will be doing more LPs. I don't know what it'll, what it'll be, perhaps. Probably another Mario Kart game, maybe. Who knows. Uh, this is where my rocket should be. Uh, no idea where it is now. It should still be there, technically, shouldn't it? Oh dear. Anyway, let's get some more seeds. I am watching the time. I've got about a minute and a half left. So, uh, but in, well, for the recording of stupid YouTube, it, you know, it says, you must make it this long, this recording. Well, I have to keep my eye out on the timer. But I should get to 100 at least. Get overboard. Hey. Right, free fall. Good, Pikmin. Should get to 100 at least, that's pretty good. 95, yeah, I'll definitely get to 100, but we've got to explore up here now, so uh, let's go for an explore. I should have 20 reds with me, I should do. It looks like I've got 20 reds with me, let's find out. Separate! Thank you. Right, are you 20 reds? Yes, you are, good. Right, all you gotta do, chuck them through the fire, and they will take that baby home. Oh, yeah. Okay, there we go. That should be 20. Right, you what? Let's have an explore. Let's see if the uh, clampy clam pearls are here. You know what? I'll get that blue as well. Oh, wait, do I have to blow it up? Yeah, I must have to blow it up. Yeah, I'm not going to blow it up. Can't be arsed doing that. Screw that. Blowing up walls? I've completed the game already. Uh, that should do for that. I don't think there's any more I can get, though. I'm not sure. I'll squeeze through here, see if there's any more. Oh yeah, of course, there's uh, a few more. 
You know what? There's no. There's actually. I don't think there's actually any point in uh, actually finishing the uh, level. So whatever this twenty uh, brings our total to, I'm gonna end it there and say that's what we got. <laughs> You know what, screw that one. I don't want the one. So my final total on challenge mode is 119. Not not a not a hard score to beat, but that's that's all I'm gonna do. So uh, yeah, that was challenge mode. It's it's quite it's quite fun. I did okay. Did it save my score even though I quit? No, it didn't. Oh well. 119. Send me a video response of you beating that, and I will give you a shout out in my next Let's Play. But anyway, that's le that's Let's Play. That's Let's Play Pikmin. Hope you all enjoyed it. See you on the next Let's Play, guys. See you later.